Factory and today I'm going to be doing a review on this Rainbow Rocks Equestria Girls 2 pack which, which comes with Sonata Dusk and I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it and Aria Blaze from the Dazzlings. So now I've had this for a while okay um, it's been sitting back at where we put all of our stuff we need to review but now, since I finally saw Rainbow Rocks, I com I get what it means. I, I get like everything about this, and so I can, I I'm now gonna be able to understand everything I say. So anyway, I also found out that on the back, like it shows, it says complete the band, and it shows Adagio. And yeah, it's not a Digo, it's like Adagio, like right here. See, it says complete the band, and there's a singing Adagio. I found out it's not a D um a Digio or whatever I thought it was. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I thought it's I thought it was a Digo. I don't know why, but it's actually a Dogio. So there we go. So yeah, now I get everything. It was such a good movie, you guys. I, it was definitely, for surely, it was definitely better than the first Equestria Girls movie. I loved it all so much. Sunset Shimmer was awesome. I love her now reformed. She's so much sweeter. And like, I love it. Oh, I loved it all. And then like, oh, it was just so cool. I loved it all so much. Um, yeah, it was, it was really interesting. It was interesting, it was awesome. It was really cool. So, I liked it a lot. I'm trying to get them out. You know what? I'm going to work on this one first. I'm going to work on... I'm not sure who's who, though. I'm still not sure who's who. I think this might be... Is this Arya or Sonata? I really don't know. I think this one might... This one might... Wait, let me, let me see if it shows on the back. Yeah, this one's Sonata. Because it shows on the back. So, this one's Sonata, and that one is Arya. Right, so we've got the doll. Let me grab out her wings. Their wings are really cool. Oh my gosh, I loved it when they were like. I'm sorry if I'm spoiling it, but if like if you haven't seen the movie, I'm sorry because I'm about to spoil something. I loved it when they were in their siren form. That was so awesome. Like they looked kind of scary, but they looked really awesome. Like it was just so cool looking. Oh my gosh, I loved the whole movie. It was so good. Why do they come with microphones? What the heck? I thought their voices, they said in the movie that their voices were loud enough and they don't need microphones. They just sing. I loved all the songs they sung too as well. Okay, I'm gonna start with the first doll, okay? So this is um, Sonata. She's, she's really cute. So here she is, she comes with a pair of wings, which look super cool. And there's no spot, okay, here we go. Gotta pull down the back of her shirt a little. And push it in. I need to get her wing, there we go. There we go, there we go. Yeah, she's she's very cool. I like her a lot. Um, she comes with a microphone and some, it's not gonna stay in her hand, so. Uh, and some really awesome glasses as well. I think these are my favorite part. Her cutie mark is on the side of her cheek, which I can get it. There's like a lightning bolt going down a heart, and so it kind of looks like the heart is like broken. It's really cool. Um, also, her bangs, when they're laying flat, they kind of point down. Like, they come to a point, and then go back up. Like, boop, boop. <laughs> and they have a blue streak going down that connects in the back and wraps around right here and wraps her down her hair and then her hair is tied in a little ponytail right here <laughs> um yeah she has a really evil looking grin on her face as well just like that's how I mimic her um, she's got little, like, broken hearts in her eyes. Um, she's got a lightning bolt on the side of her dress. She's got a big belt with, like, a bunch of chains on them. Little, like, broken hearts and stuff. 
Then what's really cool is each of them have little gems that like make their voice like, I guess you could say beautiful, more beautiful. Cause without them, when they broke, like their voices were horrible, man. But what's really cool is her gem is, tie, is on her tie, which is really cool, which I really like it. Um, I'm gonna put on her glasses to show you guys what it looks like. You know what I don't get is how their glasses stay on without like their with their ears being all the way up here. I really don't get it. Cause you know how your glasses like rest on your ears? That's how they stay on. I really don't get it. <laughs> They're cute. And then she's got some really big boots, which I think are super cool. They've got like broken hearts on the back, like half of a heart. Um, and then they got chains up in the front. Like I said, she comes with a little blue microphone. Can she, she can stand. I think she can stand way better than like most of them because she has such thick heels and boots. So, and then she also comes with the backstage pass. I really, really, I, I wanna say I really enjoyed the Rainbow Rocks movie and I cannot wait for the next one to come out if they do have another one come out. You know what I really wanna see now? Discord in My Little Pony Equestria Girls. I hope they, you know what would be so cool is if like they did an episode where like, like it might not, it doesn't have to be Equestria Girls, but it would be so cool if they did like a My Little Pony just episode in general. It could be Equestria Girls, it, it could like not be, but like all of their enemies come back and they like some chaotic thing happens and like it brings like some new villain shows up and it brings back, like it's like, Brings back um, back memories of like fighting their villain, the um, other villains such as Sombra, Discord. It turns like Discord. It turns like it brings back all the villains. That would be super cool. Okay, that would be really really awesome. And like there's like a double of Discord, and then like all the friends have to like destroy them. Oh my gosh, her hair is awesome. I think that would be really cool. Now I'm just like starting to get off track. All right, so I got Aria out. Gotta grab her microphone, which is purple. I really like her green wings. These are, she was really cool. In the movie, she kept like telling the truth and, sh and instead, like they were, you know how they were supposed to be like lying and stuff. Um, she kept like telling the truth and she's like, yeah, she was just, she was funny. She seemed to not get anything they were talking about sometimes. Okay, let me put that on the ground. All right, so we got Aria out. She is really cool. I like her a lot. Let me put on her wings really quick. Yeah, I like I like her better out of the two twins. In the movie, I didn't like her better, but in doll form, I like her better. I thought she was pretty funny. Um, her hair is sticking out right there. <laughs> Here, let me see, can I? Eh. Nope, I guess not. <laughs> anyway, here are her wings. They are green. You know what's funny is, her cutie mark is on the other side of her cheek this time. Yeah, that's, that's funny. Even though in the picture, it shows it should be on this side. This side. But it's on this side. This is weird. Anyway, yeah. Um, you know what I also noticed, you guys? Is it shows her having a lightning bolt, but it's really a music note lightning bolt. And then she only has a star, but she has a music note behind it in the picture. I'm so confused. You know what I also noticed in the movie? Is they don't put the cutie marks on their cheeks. Didn't notice that, did you? Well, maybe some of you did. But anyway, um, she comes with a purple microphone. Same one as the other one, except just purple, like I said. She also comes with little green wings, like I showed you guys. And they just clip onto her back, but hers are not really clipping in and staying in. Well, they're clipping in, but they're not staying in. Yeah. Um, then she's got two little ponytails. And she has like little, like her hair pulled back right here. And these are like her bangs. And the rest of her hair pulled into ponytails. Um, she's got her gem right here. She's got a really cute little dress on. 
and it looks like it's tied right there. And it has a big star right there. It's all like stretchy material right here. It's kind of silky too. She's got striped tights and she's got heels with stars on them also make it for her to stand wait wait she's not as good as standing as her but she can stand pretty easily um, and she also comes with a backstage pass by the way anyway I think that is it for this review you guys I would definitely recommend the movie if you have not seen it already oh my gosh so good oh anyway I think that is it thank you all so much for watching and goodbye